G'day there. Well, we've finished the little uh, grandmother long case clock and uh, it's turned out pretty well, I think. This is the one that I've built utilising a pinwheel escapement uh, and it's working quite nicely. So we'll just move around and have a bit of a look at it. There's the pinwheel escapement. And it's all happening down in there. Seems to be a fairly bulletproof uh, escapement in that sense that uh, it doesn't. Nothing seems to worry it greatly. Once you get the maths and the accuracy right when you're building it, the rest seems to come fairly naturally. Now yeah, the pendulum went, but have a look down there. Nice long pendulum, nice slow steady arc. The weight is about uh, six kilos thereabouts. A bit of a cathedral theme in its design. And I've got two little LED lights inside it which you really can't see perhaps from around here. Yeah okay. Just illuminating the inside of it that little bit and by night it's quite a good night light as well winding it is quite simple um, little winder I've made there goes into there And that's sort of it. So, another project done, another clock left for posterity. <laughs> uh, the grandmother sized long case clock using the French pinwheel escapement concept. So, that's about it, folks. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye bye.